te iwi whānui, kei te karanga mai te krihimete, Christmas is calling and so you know what that means, it is time to get your Christmas menu sorted. And so today I'm just going to show you this little idea for trifle cups and it's really simple and super delicious and then I'm going to package it up and send it off to Kath and Kath was nominated by her dear friend Catherine who wanted to celebrate Kath getting a new job. And so I cannot wait to put these together and celebrate with you, Kath. Car pie. I love this idea for trifle cups because it means everyone gets their own little individual serving. And kia hate mahi tuatahi. What is the first job? It is to make some delicious jelly. Nā reira, koe nei ngā kai ko whakamahia e tato. Here are the ingredients you need. Kia fa koko iti powder te te te. Four teaspoons of gelatin powder. Kia hau fa kapu wai arani maota. Quarter of a cup of fresh orange juice. Kia rima raurita mana wai karani pere. Five hundred mils of cranberry juice. Kia rua hau toru kapu huka oni. Two thirds of a cup of caster sugar. Kia kotahi rako hina mona. One cinnamon stick. Kia te kau koko nui kākano pamakara nete. Ten tablespoons of pomegranate seeds. Kia kotahi raurua te kau marima karamu tūru tū. One hundred and twenty-five grams of blueberries. Add your powder te tepe and your wai arani maota into a small bowl. Kaururi here, stir it up and leave for five minutes to blend. Now add your huka one and your rako hina mona and half of your wai krani pere into a frying pan and you're just bringing this to a simmer and you want all of your huka to dissolve and then you just simply pour this off into a pot Straight into a pot it goes, and then you want to pour in the second half of your wai krani pere, and it is cold so it will help cool it down. Now you want to grab your gelatin mixture and melt it in the microwave for 20 seconds, and then pour it in as well. Now into six to seven glasses, add your kākano pamakara nete and your tūrutu. Divide them up, and then divide in your ranunga tiere, your jelly mixture. I love how simple that jelly is to make and it only takes around an hour to set and while it is setting you can make the simple keke ko punga punga sponge cake. Now it is so simple to make but I do know for many of you if you are making a trifle you just want to use a store bought one and I'm not going to judge you. Kaya koe te tikanga, it is up to you. Kia toru hiki, three eggs. Kia kotahi kokoiti iho hū pere, one teaspoon of vanilla. Kia haufa kokoiti tope, quarter of a teaspoon of salt. Kia haurua kapu huka one, half a cup of kāsa sugar. Kia toru te kaumārima kramu pata, 35 grams of butter. Kia toru haufa kapu puehu parawa, three quarters of a cup of flour. Kia haufa kokoiti pēkana powder, quarter of a teaspoon of baking powder. Mahi keke ko punga punga, let's make some sponge, add your three heki into a bowl, along with your iho hupide and your tote. Whakapa huka huka tia, whip it on up, and you want to whip this for about two minutes until it goes from that colour to this colour, light and fluffy in appearance. Now you want to slowly, as you continue to whip, add your huka one, a little bit at a time, and in total you want to whip this for around another five minutes, and you know the deal, Ethefano. You need to whip until your mixture can hold a figure eight, like that. We draw the eight, and it stays there. Kapai kuerite. Now we add our puehu parawa, mitepe kana powder, flour, and baking powder. Get sifted in. All of it goes in. Whackity whack whack, and then we just want to gently, very very gently fold this in. Now add your pata in two parts. It has been melted and has cooled for about five minutes. Do not add this hot etefano. Kapai, so that's the second part of the melted pata. Gently, gently fold it through and then it is done. Pania kiroto ite ipu keke, spread it into your line tin, 20 by 30 centimetres is the size. And remember when you spread it, just be really careful, don't press down too much. Keeping all that lovely air. Put the wild tunu cake. Yeah, it's time to bake our cake. Into a 165 degree oven for 11 minutes. Perfect. 
one golden keke ko punga punga coming right up. How good does that look? So easy to make and delish. And now we just have two more elements to prepare before we assemble it all. So we just have a creamy, a mixed cream, and we've got a delicious store-bought custard going through that as well. And then we're just going to make these really delicious little white chocolate decoration-y things. Kia rua rau, rimitikau kramu creamy kuku, 250 grams of thickened cream. Kia hautoru kapu creamy, one third of a cup of cream. Kia hautoru kapu puehuhuka, one third of a cup of icing sugar. Kia kotahi kokunui wanida, one tablespoon of vanilla. Kia kotahi mete haufa kapu kahitete, one and a quarter cup of custard. Kia kotahi rau, rimitikau kramu tiakarete ma, 150 grams of white chocolate. Kia rua hautoru kapu nati kua tapahia, two thirds of a cup of chopped nuts. Kia unopai hana pere. Tauraki tio, six freeze dried poison berries. Kia toru hau fa kapu mire one and three quarters of a cup of vanilla syrup. Kia kotahi koko nui one One tablespoon of vanilla. Kapai, add your creamy kuku and your creamy into a bowl along with your puehuhuka and one Whakapā huka huka tia. Whip it on up until it is luscious and thick. That's what we want and now we add in our kahi tete. This is store bought but still luscious. Mix it through and now it's time to chill it. Now we move on to our tia kurete ma. We want to melt this gently in the microwave. Pania te tiakere te mā, kia porohita te āhua. You want to spread the chocolate until it turns into a circle and you want these circles to be slightly wider than the rim of your glasses. Then with the remainder, you just want to spread it out as we're going to make some little shards. Sprinkle over your nati kua tapa hia, your chopped nuts. And poi hana pere tauraki tio, freeze dried poison berries. Chill those in the fridge and now we move on to our keke ko punga punga. We've just got a cup the same size as our glasses that we're putting them in and now they need some flavour so we add our miere wanida and our iho hukure into a bowl. Give that a little stir and baste each one of these sponges on both sides with the syrup. Ka pai! So we have all of our elements done now. We've got our tieri, our jelly is all set. We've got our delicious little keke ko punga punga soaked in wanida. We've got our cream ready and our little white chocolate dazzly bits. Nā reira, me tsimata tato. Let's assemble our trifle cups. Kao pai, so let's add a sponge on top of our beautiful jelly. And then I just drizzle over a little bit more of our delicious vanilla syrup, around about one tablespoon. And we keep persisting with that deliciousness. How goes that? vanilla syrup and now it is time for our chill creamy. I am piping it but you know you can spread it if you want to. Now it's time for our chocolate shards. I just break them into little tiny pieces and add them in for texture. And then our nutty kuatapa here. Our chopped nuts get sprinkled over the top for extra texture and deliciousness. Kath, I hope that your new job is all that you hope it to be and it is filled with wonderful people. Congratulations, Ewa, and I hope that you can sit down with your whanau, pretend it is krehimete, and enjoy these delicious trifle cups. Kia koutou katoa ara ko te hunga mā takitahi to all of you viewers. Is this worthy of your te pū krehimete, your Christmas table? Ingari mo tēnei wā, ko oti te mahi, our job is all done and I will see you all again next time. Mā te wā. Mai tōku kaita ki tō kaita, ki ki ana ki te aroha. Pane, spread, panea, spread it. Panea te tiakere te mā kia porohita te ahua. Spread the white chocolate into a circle. Taraifara, trifle.